Hello, guys. In this lesson, we're going to talk about adding items in your catalog. Let's get started. Once you have enabled your shop tab on your Facebook page, it must show the products that you are selling to entice buyers to purchase from you. You can use your business suite to access your commerce manager and start adding products to your shop. To add items to your shop, go to the commerce menu. Select the business account and the Facebook page where you need to access your Facebook shop. There are different ways that you can add items on your catalog. On your commerce overview, you can click the button Add Items, or you can go to the catalog menu and access the submenu items. If you choose to click on the Add Items button, you will be redirected to this page and start adding items. And if you click the catalog menu, then select Items, you can view a list of existing items in your catalog here. If there are no items yet, you can view this welcome page that informs businesses that this is the section where you can manage your inventory information. You can add all the items that you want to advertise or sell, and you can display them in ads and shops. If you click to add items, you can choose to add multiple items or add one item. First, you need to provide basic information to let buyers know what you are selling. Upload the image for each product in your catalog. You may notice that you can add only one photo, but if you click on the Advanced Radio button, you can upload additional images here. Then add a title for your item. It can be up to 150 characters long, but it is recommended to use 65 characters for your title. Next, add a description for your item. Include any unique features to help people understand its benefits. This can help your buyers in their purchasing decision. Next, add a website link where your buyers can view more details and buy this product. This is optional. You can include a page link of that product in this field. Then set the price for your product. First, choose a currency, then set the full price of the product in this field. You can also set that the item is on sale to attract more buyers to purchase your items, since people love getting discounts. Just set a discounted price in this field, and this is what your buyers will see as they view your product. Next, add a condition of the product. You can choose from new, refurbished, used fair, good, or like new. Then type in the brand name. You can add an optional content ID, which is useful for large inventories where you can assign SKU to each item in your inventory. Next, choose a category. You can choose the most specific category that applies to your product. Click Next. Under Display Options, you can set the item as active so that it can be seen by people or the item is in stock to make it available for purchase. Next, add more details here. This will depend on the category that you have chosen for your product. On the next page, you can create variants such as having different sizes, colors, or patterns for a product. Once you're done, click Finish. You can see that the item was added to your catalog. If you need to add more items, you can click Add Another Item and manually add them here. The items that you have added will be shown in this section. You can click on the product and view the details, archive, delete, or edit the item. The Media tab shows the link assigned to the images and videos for the product, view the channels, and variants. If you need to promote your products or services using email marketing, we have a marketing app that can help your emails get into the inboxes of your leads. With Mail Engine, you can send emails using Gmail and G Suite legitimately. Second, it has a feature of content spinning the subject and body. Third, it has JavaScript redirection. Each email goes out with a new URL, but the recipient is taken to the correct page as it clicks on it. Fourth, inbuilt spam filter words detector. All autoresponders have spam words filter. Mail Engine has a built in detector for these words. Mail Engine has a simple three step mailing freedom that includes installing it on your hosting, import your lists, and start mailing. So try Mail Engine now. Go to mailengine.in. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.